what went through your mind when you knew that you were going to be in charge of creating this this replica? It absolutely flattered me because this this guitar is what got me into guitar playing. So it was like everything I had been working for had just come full circle. So you were a fan of Ed's music and his guitars previous to this project. His music is what got me into this. How long? Have, when was the first time you heard Van Halen? 1984 album. Yeah. I wore it out. I bought it on tape. I wore that out. Changed your life? The first CD I ever bought when CDs came out was 1984. Changed your life? Changed my life. This man and, and this guitar. And, you, and you, you play as well. You have a, mm -hmm. You've been playing since you were a kid? Mm hmm So, I mean, aside from... I think ooh. he needs to be able to play in order to do what he did. Oh, I think so, too. Yeah. It helps when you're a guitar builder to play it. Was the... Was, was, was the impression that you got from Van Halen or Van Halen music, was it guitar first and then you became interested in the building process or were you, were you interested in the building process uh, early on or how did that you know, work? It, it was early on I got into it. The first guitar I bought was an Area Pro 2 Les Paul copy and I tore it apart and I spray painted it and was constantly messing with it. I think that there was an aspect of, that, that Ed was putting out there in the world where everybody like it wasn't just enough to be a player but you had to fuck with your guitars too you at had, the same time you, you know it was, it was cool to. it was mm -hmm. cool Ed made it cool did Ed inspire the way you build guitars at all or, or did, did he really provide an impetus to become a builder a little bit of both his his technique and building you know make it work for yourself you know, just go at it, whatever it takes. I mean, uh, you told me that you chiseled this out, right? Yeah, yeah, man. Well, look at it. <laughs> you know, I, I kind of did the same thing. pro job. <laughs> I, I would take guitars and just, just destroy them, you know, just yeah. trying to get what I want. And then as I learned, on, you know, how to work on guitars and got better at building and everything, then I started making them a little more polished and... Well, how did you go about building the guitar? What was what was the process like? You've got you've got the project now. It's yours. You know, you're 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 going through a, a thought process. You know, when you actually got to a table. This and is got, what I want to know. How did I, you do it? I absolutely geeked I mean, he, out on he it. Even got the damn reflectors that we bought at a truck stop. And because at the end of the show, when when the whole VH logo came down. I'd go <laughs> like that. Yeah, shoots a prism out over the yeah, crowd. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Now, uh, where the hell did you find these damn things? That was a lot of research. I found <laughs> <laughs> it, to put it uh, mildly. It, it took a long time. I tried to find the original manufacturers, uh, one of which had gone out of business. So it it, it was kind of tough finding the exact reflectors. But the we did it, and like, I spent months, you know, just going through it, yeah. looking at every picture I could find of the guitar. Wait. Just dissecting every little screw hole, every you know piece it's of crazy, flaked off man. finish. You, you call it a geek out. It's I, a geek I, I, out process. Yeah, I just picked it apart, probably further than anybody should pick anything apart. I mean, I, I just wanted to nail every little detail on the thing, and, and I did the best I did. could. That you did, even down to the screw holes to what the tuning pack. Well, I mean, what you know, I so many different tuning pegs in this guitar. He even nailed that. The thing for me. That, that blows me away more than anything about what you did is that you did this without that guitar. Without you did the, the entire thing from you photographs. Did. You never had the real guitar to base the thing off of. Mm -hmm. that, that's just mind-blowing to me. Yeah. Well, I had a bunch of photographs and like I said, I was zooming stuff in and just, like I said, geeking out on it. do from a photograph? It wasn't easy. It wasn't easy. I mean, I just did the best I could, but I, I, I had grown up with this guitar, though. I mean, I had pictures of this hanging on my wall as a kid, you know? I, I, I did, just too. I knew this guitar inside and out. It was a part of my life coming up, you know? That's so special, you know? And, and like I, I said earlier... It's a part of both of ours. It's yeah. a part of all of ours, yeah. you know? It was. It was part of a lot of people's lives. And it just, like I said, once I got to working on this, it just felt like everything had come full circle. It was such an honor. How did you feel? after you talked to Ed, because you weren't with the guitar when the guitar got delivered to Ed, mm -hmm. but once, you know, Ed had seen the guitar and called you and you knew that he was happy and excited with the guitar, you know, how did that make you feel? It blew my mind. It was, it was a great day. It really was. That's a day to remember in your life. Definitely. Yeah. A pivotal moment. I'm as impressed as anybody could be. I, I, you've done yeah. a, you've done a I'm so, amazing... I'm sitting here playing a replica and it feels better 
than the real one. There's just so much detail and, and, and so much that went into building this guitar and it's so exciting. It's one of the most famous guitars in rock and roll history. It'll be an icon a hundred years from now. People will know exactly what it, what, what it is mm. and what it was. And, you know, I'm just glad it was you. And I just think it's fantastic how, how happy Ed is with it. I have one question for both of you guys. Yeah. Um, have you ever confused the replica with the original? Yes. When, Really? That's why I wrote this on the back. <laughs> <laughs> so we have a picture sitting on the yeah, tailgate yeah, of my yeah, car. Yeah, We're yeah. all yeah. looking at three of them at mm -hmm. once, wondering which mm. one's which. They're amazing. Yeah, they are. Well, thank you both for sitting with me and, uh, and answering I'm some questions. You.